Okay, the original poster wanted to uh, know how to quickly texture one of the physics structures. I uh, mentioned the tank and the conveyor belt, and was worried about having to uh, add parts and attach objects to make something look realistic and to look real because uh, when you render you're going to get uh, pretty much nothing there you obviously when you turn on your dummy or when you render that dummy there'll be nothing there so uh, but you can texture and uh, all you need to do is uh, bring up your folder with your textures in it and grab a texture and just drop it on top of that uh, physics structure and uh, you can texture it that way uh, find something that'll work for your tracks. Now be careful, make sure to select the right object and uh, you'll probably want to adjust that texture, you know, change the size, maybe turn off reflection, let's say, uh, make all kinds of changes to it. And then you can use the paint bucket and just simply go through and texture the physics structure, which is made up of dummy objects and those dummy objects uh, tend not to render. So the other thing you'll need to do, uh, so this will render, is simply go through and uh, select your object there and go over here and uh, you can use your shift key and select multiple objects that make up that physics structure. Come up here and turn off dummy and once you turn that off, and I grabbed the wrong one, but bottom line is we'll need to do it to that tank track as well. So we'll just select again and use the uh, shift key, select everything, and turn off set as dummy. And now when this renders, uh, you'll be able to see it. Uh, if you hit control D, you see only that object right there. So we're going to take that center structure and make sure that uh, it is right here and tank set that there and now control D and now only those other objects and you can uh, you can change the opacity of those objects and render them if you choose but uh, that's one quick down relatively down and dirty way to uh, texture a physics prop a uh, physics structure and now it will render and work correctly and of course we'll have to texture that as well so it just takes a little more time now I've got one uh, that I worked on over here the one that opened up the video and this is pretty much the same thing I have now attached some various objects to the physics structure and uh, given it some uh, personality if you will uh, so uh, you can do that you can certainly add objects to it and attach objects to your structure but you don't have to and you can simply texture them just make sure you turn off set as dummy so that it will render when you animate